Hey gang, how everybody doing? Hopefully everybody's doing really, really good. Just want to give everybody a really quick tour of the PC. So it's pretty much going to be like an episode of MTV Cribs, for any of you guys remember that. We're just going to be going through uh, the PC instead of going through the bathroom and showing you my car collection. So, first off, what I want to start with is the hard drive. The hard drive is right here. Hard drive is right here. The hard drive is what we call non-volatile memory. So when something is non-volatile, what that means is that if the PC turns off, then all of the information that's on that device will stay there. If it's volatile, then as soon as the PC loses power, everything's gone. So this hard drive is a non-volatile hard drive. This is a traditional hard drive. A traditional hard drive has moving parts. So it has a platters, it has trays, so on and so forth. So it has things that move around in there. And over time, they actually wear down. They'll wear down and they'll break. So traditional hard drives aren't as durable as solid state drives. And a solid state drive is a drive that doesn't have any moving parts. It's a solid part. So another thing I want you guys to look at is this red cable. So this red cable right here. So this cable is going from the hard drive to the motherboard. That's what we call a, sorry, had to put a little oomph into it. <laughs> uh, this is called a SATA cable. So this is a SATA cable. One end goes directly to the motherboard. So the green space, it goes directly to the motherboard. Then the other part goes directly to the hard drive. So the main purpose of this SATA cable, see says SATA right there, if we can zoom in, maybe, focus. But this is a SATA cable. Uh, the color doesn't really matter, so don't really focus on that too much. It's just that this is what actually transfers data. So the motherboard knows, okay, this is a hard drive. This is the information I need to send to it. So everything on this PC needs two things. One, a way to transmit data, and two, a way to be powered. So bam, we got the way for the hard drive to be, uh, to transfer data. Now how is it powered? It's gonna be powered right here through this cable. So if we unplug this cable, this is our power cable. This is our power cable. So this is going directly from or coming directly from the power supply. So this is the hard drive. This is the SATA data cable. This is the power cable coming directly from the power supply. Remember everything in here needs two things, a way to transmit data, a way to actually be powered. Power supply here goes through all these little cables then connects directly into the hard drive. Pop quiz. Is the hard drive volatile or non-volatile? And whichever one of those it is, what does that even mean? And 54321, it is volatile. Is it true or false? Hopefully you said false. The hard drive is non-volatile, which means that if this whole thing turns off, which it is right now, um, then everything that's on the hard drive will be saved. Another thing I forgot to uh, mention, make sure when you open up the case, everything is off. Of course, everything is actually off and unplugged in this scenario, but just make sure that when you're doing what you're doing, that you unplug everything and that you use an anti-static wrist strap. Now, it would be cool if that's what this was, but it's not. Um, all you have to do is if you don't have an anti-static wrist strap, you can touch an unpainted surface of the case so you can transfer the uh, static electricity that you may have built up from yourself to the case so you don't actually damage any of the components inside this case so let's keep on going so this entire green thing this big green thing is the motherboard super super important everything that we need is going to be on this motherboard but before we get to that we got the hard drive over here got the SATA cable then over here, 
we have the optical drive. 